Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. This is gonna be a really quick video because any moment now our customer is gonna about to come and pick up this bike. But before they do, I really wanted to share this amazing build with you because I think you're gonna be really interested. This is the Hansling CEX Evo gravel bike frame and it is uh, a beauty. Now, whenever a manufacturer is willing to put their bare carbon unfinished frame on display, you've got to take notice because the finishing is all out there for you to see and it is really, really nice. What paint there is on it, just on the down tube, is really, really lovely paintwork, but the finishing of the carbon, you've just got to see it to be believed. It is, it's stunning. It actually looks beautiful, marbled effect. The bottom bracket went in smoothly. The headset went in smoothly. It is a really nicely finished frame. I think they're gonna love it. So some unusual things on this bike. We actually fitted them up with a set of Pacetti mountain bike wheels. So these are the 30 millimeter internal rims, the PI 30s. Very wide for a gravel bike, but fitted up with the Pirelli Cinturano's um, 45 wide tires. They make the give the tire profile a really good, robust feel. Now this is going to be used for Lake District gravel, which is essentially mountain biking. So this combination, is, I think, is going to work really well. Give our rider loads of confidence um, on the descents. On the handlebars, we've actually gone for a full FSA setup with the stem and handlebars from the gravel range, giving that nice flair. And of course, that leads on to the highlight of the whole build: the SRAM Force Access um, levers. So full hydraulic brakes, uh, the electronic shifting, of course. Left hand makes it easier, right hand makes it harder. It's as simple as that. But we've linked this up with the SRAM X01 rear mech. Now. We've also got to cross our streams a little bit by going for a Shimano 10 through to 51 cassette. Um, the reason we've done this is because the, the weather and the grit and stuff here in the Lake District really destroys chains and cassettes. So this is a much more cost effective way of keeping up to date with um, having good serviceable parts on your bike without costing the earth. Of course, match these up with the Truitive Stylo Cranks purely because <laughs> the, um, the crank lengths are absolutely ideal. You could also get the absolute black oval chain ring on there that our customers absolutely love. These are direct link ones, they just slot on so easily. Um, and the colors just match that like blacked out carbon with the white logo in, just ties in. Now, special little map deck finishing touch on this. We spoke to our friends over at Tie Bike who make titanium bolts he came in to get some, um, some brakes fitted from us and we showed him this bike. He was like, I've got to sort some bolts out for this. So he went and photocopy, um, photographed the, um, the bolts on all the SRAM components and then went back and found a color matching anodizing process so that we could have these little bolts here and the bolts on the bottle cages all matched to the same color as the SRAM stuff as well. It's just it just hides those obvious bolts by color matching them, just makes it look like part of the bike and it is such a nice finishing touch. So thank you, Tire Bike. Brilliant. Oh, what do you guys think? Please let me know in the comments below. I'll be really keen to hear what you think about this crazy uh, custom gravel bike. Cool, see you on the next video.